Guys, finally, the hate against Nigerians is reducing. <laughs> Don't play. When I said that we are going to achieve this big dream, hmm? many of you thought I was joking. I can remember back just five years ago, 10 years ago. I can remember now. For a Nigerian to get a job in Dubai, for a Nigerian to get a job in the UK, for a Nigerian to get some kind of positions, Niger the Nigeria will have to pass through. It will be like an elephant passing through a needle eye. Every Nigerian can testify to you what they have been through as a Nigerian just because they are Nigerians. But let me be specific and let me be clear. The hate against Nigerians in America, in Europe, in the white world, the Europeans, the Americans, they are the ones that are actually changing their view of Nigeria. They are actually already changing the way they see Nigerians. They are actually changing the way they treat Nigerians. The change is becoming extremely visible enough. Nigerians in the UK can testify. They can begin to testify. Nigerians in America, Nigerians in Europe, they can begin to testify that, guys, it's no longer that harsh. Even though there is still some stigmatization, that's, we are not going to stop because we have to continue preaching and showing the world who Nigerians truly are. Have you recently discovered that? There are so many people now on social media fighting for Nigeria. Have you discovered that there are so many people on YouTube, so many people on TikTok? These are not even Nigerians. So, because eh, I haven't seen Nigerians who do this thing we are doing, who put up the camera, create content to promote Nigeria, to show that Nigeria is a good country, to show that Nigeria is a good that Nigerians are good people. I don't see Nigerians doing that. Rather, surprisingly. God has raised people from all over the world to be preaching that Nigeria is a good country. Nigerians are good people. What Nigerians can do, nobody else can do it. God raised people from... That is... Nigerians, you people have to... You people have to stop a little bit and think about this. You people have to give yourself some little moment to think. Where do you think it came from? That out of a sudden, we are seeing YouTube channels, TikTok channels, White people, even white people, white people talking about Nigerians as good people, Nigeria as a great country, Nigerians as powerful people, the impact that Nigerians are creating in Europe, the impact that Nigerians are creating in America, out of a sudden, the number, I am one of the first people that started defending Nigeria on social media back in 2019, 2018, that's when we started struggling to prove the world that Stop the negativity about Nigerians. Stop describing them to be who they are not. Stop generalizing Nigerians. I'm the one of the people that started this movement. And to my greatest dismay, guys, I don't even want to talk of the African content creators that I know on TikTok, on YouTube, and many other platforms. I don't want to mention them. But look at the number of European platforms. You, you white people on TikTok encouraging Nigeria food encouraging Nigeria music, encouraging Nigeria movies. I mean, Nigeria is literally content now for white people, for everybody. And majority of them, they have changed the narrative. They have gone from criticizing Nigeria as one of the worst countries in the world to celebrating Nigeria as one of the best countries in the world. Celebrating Nigerians as one of the best people in the world. Guys, this is a miracle. Maybe Nigerians don't see it yet. But guys, when I go, when I go take time, look, oh, when I go take time, look, because what we started has gone global. There are more people now showing the world that Nigerians are good people than the people who are busy trying to destroy the reputation of Nigeria. And like I've always said, majority of the people right now who, who say negative things about Nigeria on social media, majority of the people who have YouTube channels that are against Nigeria, Majority of the people who come online to criticize and say all sorts of things about Nigeria. Hmm? Number one will be Nigerians. Number one. Number two will be Africans who don't like Nigerians. And you already know them. Ghanaians, South Africans. You will not see any information negative about Nigeria that is not coming from these two sources. It will either be a Nigerian, 
I don't want to mention whether it's an Igbo or Yoruba or whoever. It will be a Nigerian or it will be a Ghanaian or it will be a South African or it will be another African who is just jealous and envious of what Nigerians are doing. You understand? But right now in the world, there are more people that are showcasing what Nigerians are doing in America, what Nigerian music is doing to the world, what Nigerian entertainment is bringing to the world. We are even seeing Indians, Chinese. I mean, we have seen it all. And suddenly, there's a prophecy that is almost about to come true. Because there's a prophecy about Nigeria that says that a time will come where everybody would wish they were Nigerian. A time will come where people will wish they had Nigerian passport. A time will come where Nigeria will be a country of pride. A country where people will, will, will see as wow. And once the social media movement start changing, once the narrative start changing the way it's changing now, guys, wake up. Wake up, because time done the reach. Oh. Time done the reach, one day. <laughs> Charlie, Charlie, my brothers. It's about time Nigerians understand, man. Because it's not easy what Nigerians have gone through. The celebrations is not yet enough. The way they take, describe Nigeria for this social media, the kidnapping, the insecurities, the Yahoo people, they, all the negative things where they talk about Nigeria. Hmm? Even the little good they are saying now is not yet enough. We have to do more. Thanks to Nigerians as well, because Nigerians have never given in to the narratives. Nigerians stood their grounds and continue showing the world that Nigerians are great people. They continue showing everywhere they go that Nigerians are the best in education. Nigerians are the best doctors, the best engineers, the best politicians. They continue showing the world that Nigerians can produce the best music. Nigerians can produce the best movies. Nigerians can be the best at whatever they decide to be the best in. And that has contributed a lot to help us who love portraying Nigeria as a great country. To show the world that, you see, this is who Nigerians are. They are not what you people thought they were. It is what it is. Your boy Adjo Mark on this one again. Smash the like button. Smash the notification bell. Come back anytime you're free because there's always more beautiful and amazing videos just for y'all. God bless y'all. Cheers.